Hello pretty people. Welcome back to Indi Swad. I am super excited to get back to you all with a new recipe after such a long time. We are going to make some really hot hot delectable snacks to enjoy with our evening tea. So the recipe of the day is bread fritters or bread pakoras. First, in a vessel, take 1 cup full of chickpea flour that is besan. Now add a teaspoon of ajwain that is carom seeds, a teaspoon of rice flour, salt according to your taste, 1 teaspoon of red chilli powder and a pinch of asafoetida that is hing. Now we will dry mix all these ingredients. Now we will start adding the water to prepare the batter. Add the water little by little as you mix it slowly. It is advisable not to add all the water at once because first thing is that there might be too many lumps and it will become difficult to mix it and the second thing is if you have added too much of water then your batter will become runny. Now that we have added a cup of chopped onions, our batter is almost ready and you can see in the video this is the consistency needed for our batter. Now we will keep this aside. Take 100 grams of cottage cheese that is paneer and shred the cheese on a grater. Paneer is one of the key ingredients of today's recipe. There might be some of you who do not like paneer, right? And if you are one of those people who dislike it, I would still suggest you to give it a go because I am sure that once you have these pakodas, you will be left licking your fingers and craving for more. So coming back to the recipe, if your cheese is very soft, you can directly mash it with your fingers instead of using a grater. Now that we have shredded all the cheese, we will add half teaspoon of black pepper powder and salt according to taste. While adding salt, remember that you have already added salt in your batter and we do not want to make the pakodas too salty. Now we will cover this paneer mixture and keep it aside. What we have next with us is cheese bread. Take sufficient amount of cheese bread and apply it on one side of a slice of bread. Here I have used wheat bread but you can also use the regular one. Now we will spread the paneer mixture on the coated slice of bread. Spread it generously. Now in the same way we will apply cheese on another slice of bread also. Here instead of using the plain cheese bread, you can experiment with the taste by substituting it with plain butter, almond butter, peanut butter or any other flavored cheese bread of your choice. Now that we have prepared the pieces of bread, in a thick paste vessel, we will pour sufficient cooking oil to fry the pakodas and heat it on a low to medium flame. Meanwhile, cut the bread pieces diagonally to get the triangular pakodas. Now, take each piece of the sandwiched bread and dip it in the batter to coat it evenly. Make sure to coat the piece of bread on all sides properly without leaving out any gaps. Otherwise, your paneer stuffing may fall out at the time of frying. Now carefully lower it into the hot oil and let it fry for a few minutes on a medium flame. Flip the pakoda to fry it on the other side. Wait for another 2-3 to three minutes. And now our pakoda is perfectly done and is ready to be taken out of the oil. Take them out of the oil and lay them on a clean tissue to absorb the excess oil. And here our yummy licious fritters are ready. You can have these as it is or dip them in a sauce of your liking. So guys, that's all for today's video. Hope you liked the recipe and will definitely try it out at home. 
Do not forget to subscribe to our channel Indie Swad and hit the bell icon to stay updated. See you again in the next video with a new recipe. Till then, goodbye and take care.